will follow him. Follow him wherever he Now you just add your, your filling to it. Okay. So uh, get yourself um, a thingy. Uh, um, what you want? Is a uh, bloody hell's head on now. Can't find a bloody thing in this house. Oh. One, of them. One of those again. <laughs> Bing. <laughs> yeah, you have to get a little bit physical with these coy boys now and again. So uh, this comes in handy, okay? Right, so just. um. Just get your mix now and just pour it in there. Look at that, beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. Smells divine. Right here. There we go. Just uh, pour all that in there. Uh, beautiful. Right, now what happens is, obviously, you, you have to put it in the fridge. Okay, and uh, it actually sets. The gelatin sets it hard. The longer you leave it, the better it's going to be. Don't be in a rush to eat it. Okay? So what we'll do is... Um, I'll have another glass of wine. <laughs> While we wait, I'll just watch it. <laughs> no, seriously. We'll put it in the fridge now. And um, we'll come back to it in... Um, about four or five hours, and uh, we'll show you the, uh, the end result. Okay, so thank you for watching, and um, join me in part six, and uh, we will take a look at the finished article. Okay, so bye bye, see you soon. God bless. <laughs>
leave it in the fridge longer if you want to. There you go. There is a nice piece of um, cheesecake. <laughs> okay, there we go. Lovely. Right, very crunchy. Very, uh, you can see it's set now. Obviously leave it in the fridge for as long as you want so you're ready to eat it. So, as I said before, this is dedicated to um, Daryl, <laughs> Daryl, yes, and Valerie, okay, and, uh, and Tracy as well, a couple of my parishioners, Tracy and, uh, and Paul. Yeah. So, uh, give it a go, see how you get on, it's very nice, and uh, are you going to eat this now? with a nice glass of communion wine. <laughs> so, until next time, God bless and take care. Goodbye. Follow me.